Hello everybody and thank you for tuning in for this brand new episode about Lord of the Lost from the More from the In-Depth series. In this video we will take a closer look to many Lord of the Lost albums from the early years up to some more recent ones on CD, vinyl and even a music cassette. So make yourself comfortable because I'm sure you will enjoy the presentation and pay attention because if you are lucky you can win two surprise items and one cool painting related to an album artwork realized by the one and only Susan Fine Art Studio. Without any further ado, let me add something interesting to the already told story. As I said in my first video, I had the opportunity to see and meet the guys two times, first time in my hometown and second time in Budapest. The first show is more memorable for me because I had the opportunity to meet the guys before and after the show and I also got a lot of signatures from them. If you would like to see the full story about my experience from the two shows, you can click on the link from the end of this video and it will send you to it. But what you won't see there is the guys riding pink flamingos on a lake. And you know why? Because I will show you now in this video. So here are the boys having fun in my hometown not far from the venue and then me having a good time in the first row during the show. Herzlich willkommen zu TV of the Lost aus Cluj Napoca in Rumänien. Vom Flamingosee. Vom allseits bekannten Flamingosee. Ist das nicht ein Ballettstück? Ja. Judgment awaits on who you are A mind depraved by sabotage It matters not your chosen creed Your given faith can be redeemed I declare truth is all Erstes Mal Rumänien! There's a point before the deed to which you can't return. When thoughts bleed in to action, guilt finds your heart to burn. Yes, that was me right there. And now, let me show you some recordings I made during the show. And you think like you play in some little bar with 25 people showing up. But you never, ever expect that. A crowd like you guys singing along every word from the first song. We never fucking been here. What the fuck? Thank you very much.
cool, cool memories. And my second show was in Budapest, as I said, where I gathered many unforgettable memories. Here you have some recordings from the TV of the Lost Budapest episode, where you will see the guys having a good time before the show and me rocking the first row. Herzlich willkommen zu TV of the Lost aus Budapest, Ungarn. Yeehaw! Wollen wir weiterfahren oder was? Nicht mich filmen! Nicht mich filmen, wenn ich versuche, mich auszuziehen! Ja, geht doch. Out of the Los. That's us. Out of the Los. Wir haben Band haben gewechselt. It was epic! And now, here you have some recordings I made during the show. And with this, the story about my two shows is complete. Next time I will see the guys will be next year in April, in Budapest again, I already got my ticket for the show and I'm looking forward for a VIP and a meet and greet upgrade. Fingers crossed.
And now let's see to what we will take a closer look in a moment. Actually, almost all of the albums besides Torstar, which was presented in the previous video, and Blood and Glitter together with the Swan Songs, which will be the subject of the video next year after the show. But now here we have the anniversary edition of The Fears, the original of The Die Tomorrow and the anniversary edition of The Die Tomorrow, From the Flame into the Fire, But now, here you have the anniversary edition of Fears, the original of Die Tomorrow, the anniversary edition of Die Tomorrow, the Antagony on vinyl, CD and cassette, From the Flame into the Fire and all the way up to Judas, on vinyl and CD, and we also have an EP and a cool compilation. Cool collection, isn't it? And now, prepare yourself because we will take a closer look to all of this. Enjoy! This is the 10th anniversary edition of the Fears album in Digipack with the new cover artwork. As we open it, we see the CD to the right and the pocket with the booklet in it to the left. On the back we have the tracklist. The booklet is signed by the guys and it has 12 pages and inside we have all the lyrics and some cool pictures with Chris. My favorite song from this one is Dry the Rain. Next one is From the Flame into the Fire album on CD in Jewel Case. Cool artwork on the front and under the CD. Tracklist on the back. The booklet has all the lyrics and a cool band picture in the middle, total of 12 pages. Favorite song from this one is Six Feet Underground. Next is the Till Death Do Us Apart compilation on two CDs in Digital. On the first CD we have the Best Of, and on the next CD we have the Red. In the center we have a pocket with a booklet in it. The booklet is signed by the band and it has 12 pages. Contains the tracklist and some pictures from an ink studio. Favorite song from the rarities is Love in a Time of War. Next is the Empyrean album on CD in Jewel Case. With the tracklist on the back, of course. The signed booklet has 18 pages, containing all the lyrics and a nice band picture in the center of it. My favorite song from this one is Black Oxide. And here we have the Heartbeat of the Devil EP in DigiSleeve with 5 brilliant songs. CD in the right sleeve, booklet in the center, which has 8 pages containing the title song lyrics and a picture of every band member. Favorite song from this one is Wig in a Box. And this is the 10th anniversary edition of the Antagony album. On the back are the title of the tracks. As we open it we see a picture of the Lord and the credits on the left. The vinyl is the double gatefold clear edition. Actually it's the only edition available. On the first disc we have 8 tracks, 4 on each side.
On the second disc we have the remaining 7 tracks, 4 on side C and 3 on side D. The double CD of the same edition of the album. On the first CD we have the actual album and on the bonus CD we have a demo, a cover and some instrumental songs. Very cool CD. The signed 20 page booklet has all the lyrics and the cool artwork. We even have two pictures of the old setup of the band. And the cassette, same tracks as on the vinyl. Ten tracks on side A and five songs on side B. My favorite song from this album is Sex on Land. This is the 10th anniversary edition of the Die Tomorrow album on vinyl in double beat for 2 black disc edition. The tracklist on the back and on the inside of the cover we have the lyrics of every song. On the cover we see the new cover artwork of the album. On the first disc we have 6 tracks, 3 on each side. And on the second disc, the same setup, 3 songs on side C and 3 songs on side D. This is the double CD edition of the same album in DigiStream. On the first CD we have the actual album like on the vinyl. And on the second CD we have a lot of bonus material. And this is the original version of the album on CD in Jewel Case. Same tracklist with no bonus CD here. And the signed booklet is exactly the same as the one in the anniversary edition. Except the front picture here is the original album artwork instead of the hardware. Favorite track from this one is from Venus to Mars. And save the best for last, here is my all time favorite album, Judas. This is the signed and dedicated box set of the album containing a total of 4 discs. Two discs for the damnation part. On the first disc we have six songs, three on each side. And on the second disc another six tracks, three on each side. In this world, oh, I'm a stranger. I am lost. The cover is signed and it has the black artwork. On the back are the titles of the songs and in the inside are all the lyrics. Favorite track from this one is For They Know Not What They Do. And the salvation part, same, two discs. Similar to the damnation discs, three songs on each side, total of 12 tracks. So far, till the day I die. 
signed cover with the white artwork, track titles on the back, and the lyrics on the inside of the cover. Favorite track from this one and from all the album is the Gospel of Judas. And the same album on 2 CD Digisleeve edition, with absolutely the same setting, 2 CDs, one for the damnation and one for the salvation part, with the same songs as the vinyl. Now the devil invites to dance, but time will heal, and we will cross the bridge, set it on fire and bury it, we run and leave this land. You say that we have to be strong or we will die. The booklet is very nicely designed. First nine pages containing the damnation lyrics with two pictures. And on page 10 and 11 we have the Judas ambigram where we turn the booklet 180 degrees and we turn the pages backwards. Then we have a picture of each band member. Then all the lyrics for the salvation part, together with some cool pictures from the music videos. Okay, this was all for this episode. I hope you had a great time watching this video. Tell me in a comment which is your favorite album from the presented ones. I'll start. My all-time favorite is Judas. And now, if you feel lucky and you would like to have the following gift pack I will present in a moment, you will have to do three simple things to get on the names list for the following instruction. 1. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. 2. Like the video. And 3. Tell me where would you put the painting from the pack which contains three items. And these three items are 1 party balloon, 1 photo card signed by the whole band, and this little painting made by my wife which was inspired by the Antagony cover art. You should check her YouTube channel for the making of video of this painting and other beauties as well. By searching the YouTube for Susan Fine Art Studio or by clicking the link from the upper corner or from the description of this video. And now you will have exactly 3 days to do all this, after which we will see together in a live video who will be extracted as a lucky winner. I wish everyone good luck and check out the community tab to see the next video's protagonist which will be Temperance and Marco has a great video message for you guys. See you soon, take care and don't forget, all you need is love and a record player. Goodbye.